The mission Exceed is very simple. We exist to serve people with diverse abilities. Their vision is our mission. Our focus is on helping people find the jobs that they want for their lives and the activities that they want for their lives. And we're really proud of that and we think that's one of the reasons we're so successful in helping people find employment opportunities. Diverse abilities is our language for individuals who have a diagnosis of an intellectual or developmental disability. But we use it because they all have unique skills and strengths. We are sitting in one of two buses that we call the Twins. These buses have literally helped to transform our organization. I received a phone call over a year ago now from Dennis and Marie Gillum, and they said, we have a significant gift that we would like to give to a Clackamas County nonprofit that can use it to transform their organization. When we first heard about the need for buses, the, the problem sound, to, to our ears sounded something like this. Oh, those good-for-nothing buses. All we do is spend money on them. They're constantly in the repair shop, and which means we're unable to take clients where we'd like to take them, and we're spending a disproportionate amount of our budget on keeping them repaired and maintained. So Marie and I looked at each other and said, maybe we can help here. What could they do if they had two brand new buses that didn't need repairs? It gives them a it's lot a of pride, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Just uh -huh. to see it. I remember when the, the buses first drove in and they pulled into the parking lot and we all cheered. And there's a lot to be excited about. A lot. For our clients, they want a vehicle that's loud and proud. And the wrap that you see on this bus, whether you're rolling down the freeway or Oatfield Road or in Oregon City, wherever in Clackamas County, is something that our clients take great pride and joy in. I'm very happy that we got more buses to, for everybody to get out. If we didn't have it, we wouldn't be able to get out. We practice inclusion, we practice integration every day. And what we've seen, especially with these buses, is people ask questions, right? We have a QR code in the back. You take the picture and it'll go to our website. People have called Exceed and, and it's like, oh my gosh, who are you? <laughs> so to have that level of awareness, not just for Exceed, but to recognize that we want to make this an inclusive environment. And this bus has been a huge help for that. This was just a complete circle of winning all the way around. No, no other way to say it. And it's for Clackamas County. We feel a personal desire to see Clackamas County uplifted. One in eight Oregonians has a diagnosis of an intellectual or developmental disability. This population has an employment rate of approximately 25% three quarters of the folks don't work. It's not that they're not capable. Our society is challenged to be able to effectively incorporate it and work with these folks. But having spent my last five years here at Exceed Enterprises, it's not just that we help them. The individuals that we serve change all of us. And they've changed me dramatically and for the better. And I'm so thankful for the gift of the time that I have with these people every day.